sneaked in there and we got right up to his, his room. We never even knocked on the door. We heard like voices in there and was listening. And then he saw me. So they called the cops and we said, I was. We weren't going to hurt him or nothing. I mean, we just wanted to know if he was all right. I'm sure we'd appreciate that. If you look at most people who've been obsessive fans, you know, with a thousand posters all over the walls and all the rest of it, they, most of them move on to fall in love with a real person. He may look a little bit, she may look a little bit, like whoever it was. When they're really young, it's a little me, do me, me, If my children were spending all their time following someone around the country and all their money, I would begin to feel I'd gone wrong somewhere. Michael, if you're watching, never stop what you're doing, <laughs> please, because we can't live without you and... I think Pop World revolves around you, and I love you lots. Oh. And will you marry me? <laughs> Overzealous and obsessive fans may make headlines, but at the end of the day, without fans, there are no stars, and the size of the post bag still measures success. You know, I get people who just write every day of the week. Then you write back and say, what? You know, they just write nonsense, you know. Right? But, well, God bless them all, you know. <laughs>